Hello everyone, it's Kamal and well, I just had my two first days in film school, so let's talk about it. Hi, <laughs> I'm editing my vlog. Okay, so this is me. This what's your secret to be to be so likable on YouTube? First of all, that's so nice. Me. He features me in his vlog. <laughs> <laughs> That's about the first day of school. Look, the reason why. This is us. This is us. Subscribe to me. This is my channel. <laughs> I just had my two first days in film school and even though it's a very short experience, here's my take on it. The first thing that I want to talk about is the fact that I met so many like-minded people. People who like cameras, cinema, music, art. And so it's really nice because you get to meet people who do similar things to you but in their own way, with their own style, their own techniques. You get to take from them and to give them and like start building up on your style and it's something really important since, at least personally, I'm still a beginner and so... It's really important for me when going to film school to try to build my own style. And so I met lots of really nice people and the guy that you saw in the first clip, that's Habib. He has his own YouTube channel, he does vlogs and really fun stuff. So make sure to check him out, I'll link him at the end of the video and in the description. But swiftly moving on, the second thing I'd like to talk about is the fact that we're touching on many art mediums. We're talking script writing, script reading, acting, sound, color. And some of these might not be directly linked to filmmaking, at least to what I want to do in filmmaking, but the more as it went on, the more I understood it's kind of important because these lead to some really small things that you actually really need. Like script writing and reading, for example, lead to better storytelling, and if you want to write characters, for example, to write them in a more realistic fashion. And some really different things like color and the way color works in a picture, for example, and how it works in a similar way in a movie, or acting, even though I personally don't want to act at all. It could help me direct or give directions to anyone. And so my take is the fact that touching as many art mediums as you can is one of the best things you can do, period. And the last thing I want to touch on, and I know this is short, but I only had two days experience, is the fact that I think that if you want to go to film school, you should do so. You should push through and do so. If that's really something you want to do, don't hesitate. And if in the end you find that it's something you don't want to do, well, at least you would have tried it. But I suggest that if it's something you want to do, try it out. And you'll be not only learning technique and knowledge, but you'll also meet awesome people. And I think that's really my favorite part about film school for now. And that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this shorter video, and I'll hopefully see you in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for the YouTube algorithm. And let me know in the comments what should I do next. Till then, peace out guys.